Brickman, principal second violinist with the RPO, obviously possesses talent, but that isn't all that goes into making this instrument sing. It also takes the careful expert work of luthier Ken Sullivan. What I do, I think that I do very well, is that I adjust instruments for musicians. Some people like instruments that respond very, very quickly. Other instruments like more resistance. And that's just individual tastes, and it's what you, you know, it's just part of the business of what we do when we, when we um, tailor an instrument to an individual player. Sullivan Violins specializes in bowed stringed instruments ranging from student rentals to handmade pieces of musical art. Ken traces his interest in instruments back to his childhood here as a musician and a student. I had the world's greatest woodshop teacher in high school, Glenn Procious, who really made me into a woodworker. Um, I wasn't a natural woodworker, but he really, he pushed us all and uh, did a you know, a great service to many young people in teaching us and, incur and in inspiring us. Four years with the Chicago School of Violin Making, years of repair work and networking, led Ken to owning the only shop in western New York that's a member of the American Federation of Violin and Bow Makers. The ability to adjust instruments to maintain them is very, very important in my business. People really like that they can come here and that they know that any follow-up service that's needed can be done here and will be done and will be done right. The road to Rochester led Ken and his wife and partner Carolyn to close their shop in Arizona and move to Pittsburgh. The location was good but not perfect. We had a lot of customers that were from the Eastman School of Music. A lot of the students don't have cars so they couldn't drive to get to us so they'd have to carpool or find out uh, some other way to with help from the city of Rochester, including a grant, Sullivan Violins found a prime location on East Avenue. We discovered this is the cultural hub of uh, Rochester. Uh, we have the Eastman Community School of Music, the RPO, and uh, the Eastman School, and Hochstein is only seven blocks away. Ken hopes to hire some help and welcomes anyone wanting to learn about his art. There is a lot to learn, and each musician brings something new to the workbench, but he says it's worth the effort. And when they come in and I adjust their instrument and, and make it work for them better, their expression is better, they're more comfortable playing, and they go out with a big smile on their face, and that really makes it all worth the while. Virginia Butler, Our News.